Good morning, YTPC. This is Charlie Hibbs coming at you from my lovely uh, back porch here in Kansas City, Kansas. Beautiful, cool. Is it winter yet or is it still fall? Well, whatever, it's cool. Which I like. Peterson, St. Patrick's Day. McBaron, H and H, Latakia, like Latakia, however you say it. Stuff is really good, and uh, got a little yabba, yeah, a little box to open. Not a big box, and there's a little bit of a story behind that, and it kind of comes into karma and how things all work out. I was at Smoking Pipes, so I was about to do an order. They had a pretty good sell on C&D, and I believe it was about $25 for 8 ounce 10. I had about four or five of them picked out. I was going to order them. And I thought, oh man, you know, that's quite a bit of tobacco for money, but you know, I really don't have the money to spend on it. I don't know if it was already a thing, but I noticed smoking pipes had a free delivery at 50 bucks. So I uh, dropped it down to the two tins I really needed, the two eight ounce tins, I should say. And it was, you know, about 50 bucks. Uh, made my order, was happy. And then uh, went down to uh, Deebles. And lo and behold, they had an eight ounce bag of Penzance, or a uh, Stonehaven. Sorry, I said that wrong. Stonehaven. They did not have any Penzance, or they got one of those too. That would cost quite a bit more than you know buying online but yeah I had the money for this because uh, I didn't you know make this big tobacco order I never would have went down there if I just spent 125 150 at uh, smoking pipes I only spent spent 50 so that's why I even went down there in the first place so that ended up working out good well however you want to say it So chalk that up to the uh, tobacco gods. <coughs> Warn me. It is chilly out here. Let's see, I got my knife in the small of my back. Or else do you keep it? Maybe wanted to share the karma story, but while I'm here. Open up this box. I want to get my stone haven back in the house before it freezes. It is probably about 20 degrees right now. Cleaners. Gotta have some of those. I just mainly use the extra fluffy. What do you guys use? I use the uh, thin ones on my uh, cobs. You know, kind of a narrow mouth, but just for the fall and winter tobacco. Oh yeah, I have yet to try it, but I've heard enough reviews, and I'm familiar enough with C and D. I'm pretty damn certain I'm gonna love this. I love that tin. Black frigate. You know, it's so funny. I read some reviews or watch some reviews, I should say. And they'll talk about products, you know, that I'm real familiar with. And some people get, you know, it's totally different things. I wanted to, you know, everybody has their own experience, what they have problems with, what they don't. And uh, so I'm going to 
you know, discredited someone else's experience. I mean, it's 100% rural, but I just don't have that experience. I enjoy black frigate. I love the scent, the smell. In fact, I'm gonna might as well pop these tins while I'm out here with you guys. Like I said, I don't have many pipe pals to share these sort of things with. Nothing like popping that cherry. Oh yeah, if you can only smell that. Oh, it smells so good. Even though this is probably the least scenty tin of this stuff I've had, and I've had you know, a good three or four of these large ones. I don't even know how many single tins. But yeah, I really enjoy this. I think you should give it a try. You know, don't listen to some. I mean, you know, you always want to listen. I want to say, you know, totally not pay attention to people's reviews but you know you gotta uh, count your own experience sometimes people will smoke things too wet too dry whatever and then they have a um, less than a great experience and then they say oh well you know this is bad or sometimes you know you have somebody oh this this blends awful uh, you know it reeks a lot of keto well do you like a lot of keto no well then why are you even reviewing this it's got a lot of keto in it don't smoke it for food for food sakes wow that's a toughie Oh, I'm gonna love this. I went to get some of this last winter and I never got around to it. Oh God, yeah. That's winter, for me at least. I'll be smoking on this all through the winter. All right, guys. And let's not uh, forget. It's all foggy, so you really can't see it, but I assure you that's eight ounces of Stonehaven. I had the bag, I made a video you know, opening it and was talking about the uh, tobacco karma, so to speak. And uh, I ended up making it too long, but down low, pain in the ass. I'm not real good with this. I'm not going to put a lot of effort into it. I can't even believe it. I made a 30 minute video lecturing people about buying out of esoteric and stuff. I don't do it. There were two bags of Stonehaven. I grabbed one. I could have bought two. I had the money. I just didn't have the money to piss away. Other people want to experience these things, so I try to let other people have it too. I, they have five tens of Penzance, you know, I might pick up one or two, you know, try to leave some for other people. That's just my thought on it. Hope everybody enjoys this cool fall weather, winter weather, whatever it is yet. When does winter start, isn't it? Like, I want to say it's a week away or two weeks away. Well, anyways, you guys enjoy your holiday. Be safe. Have fun. Enjoy.